Hello everyone, this is Umair Hassan. In this video, I am uh, I'm going to solve question number 8 from exercise 4a of D17 edition. And question number 8 part A is 15x plus minus 7y plus minus 18x plus 4y. You have to simplify in this expression. So combine the like terms 15x and minus 18x they are the like terms uh, so write them together 15x and minus 18x they are like terms because both have x here the coefficient is 15 here it is minus 18 and combine the terms having the variable y minus 7y minus 7y plus 4y no 15x minus 18x is minus 3x because 18 is a large number as compared to 15 15 is positive 18 is negative so you will retain the sign of the large number minus 7y plus 4y is minus 3y so this is the simplified answer for this question part number b is minus 3x plus minus 5y minus bracket minus 10y minus 7x so combine like terms terms involving x this one and the last one write them together like minus 3x minus 7x now write down the terms involving y minus 5y minus 5y minus into minus plus 10y minus 3x minus 7x is minus 10x minus 5y plus 10y is plus 5y this is the solution for this question part number c is 9x minus minus 2y minus 8x minus minus 12y let us open the brackets it's 9x minus into minus plus 2y minus 8x minus into minus plus 12y combine the like terms 9x minus 8x plus 2y plus 12y combine the like terms 9x minus 8x is 1x plus 2y plus 12y is plus 14y this is solution for this part part d is minus 7x minus bracket minus 15y minus bracket minus 2 x plus bracket minus 6y open the brackets first it's minus 7x minus into minus is plus 15y minus into minus is plus 2x plus into minus is minus 6y now combine the like terms minus 7x plus 2x plus 15y minus 6y minus 7x plus 2x is minus 5x plus 15y minus 6y is plus 9y this is the solution for this part question number 9 is simplify each of the following expressions 1 over 4x plus 1 over 3x uh, you have to take LCM uh, to simplify this one 
in order to take the LCM uh, you can make the denominator same here the denominator is 4 here the denominator is 3 so you can make the denominator same simply uh, by multiplying this denominator 3 with this fraction like this 3 into 1 and 3 into 4 x will be part of this fraction as well because x is in this one plus multiply this denominator 4 by this fraction both with the numerator as well as with the denominator and keep x here with this fraction this is 3 into 1 3x 3 into 4 12 4 into 1 4x 4 into 3 12 so 12 is that same now you can add the numerators because denominators are same and you have taken 12 as LCM. So 3x plus 4x. 3x plus 4x is 7x by 12. This is the answer. Part B, question number 9, exercise 4a is 2 by 5y minus 1 by 3y. So you have to take the LCM and you can do so by making the denominators same multiply this denominator by this fraction 3 into 2 y over 3 into 5 minus the multiply this denominator with this fraction both with the numerator and with the denominator 5 into 1 y 5 into 3. So 3 into 2, 6 y, 3 into 5, 15, 5 into 1, 5 y, 5 into 3, 15. The one denominators are same, you can take it as LCM, 15 is LCM for the denominators. So 6 y, because denominators are same as the LCM is so 6y minus 5y will give you 1y by 15. Minus 3 over 7a plus 3 over 5a you have to simplify this one. So here the denominator is 7 here the denominator is 5 make the denominator same multiply this 5 this denominator by this fraction like this 5 into minus 3 a over 5 into 7 plus multiply this denominator by this fraction 7 into 3 a over 7 into 5 5 into minus 3 is minus 15 a 5 into 7 is 35 7 into 3 is 21 a 7 into 5 is 35 LCM is 35 denominators are same you can take 35 as LCM this will become minus 15 a plus 21 a which is 6a over 35 the answer for this part question number 9 part number d is 9 over 4b minus 4 over 3b denominator is 4 here denominator is 3 back the denominator same multiply this denominator by this fraction 3 into 9 b 3 into 4 minus multiply this denominator by this fraction 4 into 4b 4, 4 into 3 3 into 9 is 27b 4 into 3 is 12 
फोर इंटू फोर इज सिक्सटीन बी फोर इंटू थ्री इज ट्वेल्व नो दैल सी एम इज ट्वेल्व इट्स ट्वेंटी सेवन बी माइनस सिक्सटीन बी वेल दैट इज अलेवन बी ओवर ट्वेल्व क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन सिंप्लीफाई द एक्सप्रेशन थ्री पी प्लस माइनस क्यू माइनस सेवन आर माइनस ब्रैकेट माइनस एट पी माइनस क्यू प्लस टू आर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल ओपन द ब्रैकेट्स इट इज थ्री पी थ्री पी प्लस इंटू माइनस इज माइनस क्यू माइनस सेवन आर माइनस इंटू माइनस प्लस एट पी माइनस क्यू प्लस टू आर कंबाइन द लाइक ड्रम्स थ्री पी प्लस एट पी माइनस क्यू माइनस क्यू माइनस सेवन आर प्लस टू आर थ्री पी प्लस एट पी इज अलेवन पी माइनस क्यू माइनस क्यू इज माइनस टू क्यू माइनस सेवन आर प्लस टू आर इज माइनस फाइव आर इन पार्ट नंबर बी यू हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ द एक्सप्रेशन वेन पी इज टू क्यू इज माइनस वन होल वन बाई टू आर इज माइनस फाइव यू सिंपली नीड टू पुट वैल्यू ऑफ पी क्यू एंड आर इन दिस सिंप्लीफाइड एक्सप्रेशन सो योर आंसर फॉर दिस वन इज अलेवन पी इन प्लेस ऑफ पी यूज टू पुट वैल्यू ऑफ पी ओवर हेयर माइनस टू वैल्यू ऑफ क्यू इज माइनस वन होल वन बाई टू विच इज माइनस वन पॉइंट फाइव माइनस फाइव आर इज माइनस फाइव पुट माइनस फाइव ओवर हेयर इन प्लेस ऑफ आर अलेवन इंटू टू इज ट्वेंटी टू माइनस मल्टीप्लाई बाई माइनस सिक्स प्लस वन पॉइंट फाइव इंटू टू इज थ्री माइनस इंटू माइनस सिक्स प्लस फाइव इंटू फाइव इज ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी टू प्लस थ्री इज ट्वेंटी फाइव प्लस ट्वेंटी फाइव योर आंसर इज फिफ्टी द वैल्यू फॉर दिस एक्सप्रेशन क्वेश्चन नंबर अलेवन इज राज इज ट्वेल्व एम ईयर्स ओल्ड His son was born when he was nine m years old. Find Raj's age five years later. Today his age is twelve m years. This is today present age. Present age for Raj. Present age of Raj. Sorry. Present age of Raj is twelve m years. Five. years later his age will be 5 years later from now his age will be 12 m plus 5 years this is his age 5 years later from now part number 2 is find the sum of their ages their ages mean age of raj and his son in 5 years time so in 5 years time age of raj as explained above is 12 m plus 5 years what will be the age of his son his son is 3 m years old today because when his son was born raj was 9 m years old today raj is 12 m years old 
so his son will be 3 m years old because when he was born raj was 9 m years old and today raj is 12 m years old so the difference is 12 m minus 9 m is 3 m so the age of his son is 3 m present age is 3 m 5 years later his age will be 3 m plus 5 years so you have to add age of raj and his son so the sum of their ages will be 12 m plus 5 plus 3 m plus 5 12 m plus 3 m is 15 m plus 10 years this is the sum of their ages this is the solution of question number 11 of exercise 4a in my next video i will upload the rest of the questions so keep watching thank you so much